Welcome. I am Romy Hooper. I will be reading Hollow World Entertainment's interview number two, How Indeed, written by N.B. Baker. Are you still confused to where you belong, Anodyne? Anodyne continued to float in silence through space, basking in the warmth of a nearby sun. Do you lay in the sun because the warmth comforts you? I lay in the sun because I like to be over hot. Makes me sleepy. Then why is hollow so cold? Why make a planet with nearly no sunny days if you enjoy the warm sunshine? Hollow was not always so cold. When I first started, there were many warm days. But as I gathered more humans and their negative emotions filled me, I was fueled with more hatred than I could imagine. As my negative emotions grew, so did the negative attributes of Hollow. So you are nothing but an empty husk, a shell that allows others empty their personality into you. The last life I lived saw what my first lives failed to see. He saw himself as not himself, just small parts of those around him. He was the only life I lived that saw that he had no personality, just a mix of personalities he had encountered as he picked and chose the parts of others he enjoyed to be a part of him. It amuses me how you lower life forms look back on what you used to be as if you have changed. Lower life form? I am a god. There are none higher than me. I used to be lowly human. Now I am eternal, a force to be reckoned with. You are nothing but a human with long life and some new tricks. You are far from eternal. You may not age, but you can still die. The universe is nothing but a small part of the multiverse, which is an atom compared to the true size of the Eterniverse. Do you really think that you are the pinnacle of creation? That great power ends with you? You are merely in the testing stage. Anodyne sat, wide-eyed, into the black. A tsunami of thoughts rushed through his mind as nervous laughter escaped his lips. So, I am just some insignificant little bug, incapable of seeing the bigger picture? I have visited the multiverse. My first humans came from another universe. I do not remember seeing any Eterniverse looming overhead. An eerie laugh filled Anodyne's ears as his head spun trying to find the source. Well, you can't see me. That does not mean that I do not exist. Simply that your thoughts are too narrow to allow you to see the bigger picture, as you put it. The only reason I am even here is because you seemed to gain access to the multiverse faster than the average. So who are you? And how do I get to see you? How indeed. If you liked this, there will be another one uploaded next week. And if you don't want to wait for the audio version, you can read Hollow World Entertainment's full collection on www.entertheholo.com. Links in the description below.